Excellency would like to ask if any of the residential school survivors would like to take this opportunity to be heard by His Holiness. My mother would like to speak in her language. Eileen Spears, Nisikasun, Nya Oste, Cree Nation. My name is Eileen Spears. I am from the Cree Nation in Manitoba, Canada. When things are too good, I'm just scared that things will be taken away. I want my children home where they should be. It's the law, Matthew. You'll go to jail if you don't sign. Think of the education they will receive. Third, the residential school system will never exist. We have 324 students that will keep them in a state of malnutrition. And if you want to motivate the Indian, you must starve him. Naturally, we're seeing a rise in sickness. Be careful. You're going to see things you never forget. You gotta keep it inside you. You didn't think your master escape would go unpunished. I need your protection. You were an Indian. I don't owe you anything. You promise me that you won't look back. You are our tomorrow. We're sending you to Lemon, putting together a special operation. The Germans haven't been able to crack our codes in Cree. How did you keep your language? We've been training all our lives. There is no way that we are going to give up when we are threatened with cultural genocide. Mom? Thing you love, what you taught them was an education in unrelenting cruelty. You are my home. You are my home.